Hey, welcome. Thanks for joining us at JK Firearms. I am Jay, your host with the most doing another product review, tabletop review of a very cool pistol that we just got in the stock a little bit ago. So we're going to go ahead and talk about that guy. But first, let's go ahead and thank all of our supporters and our subscribers here, whether you're joining us on YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, uh, Facebook, anything at all. Thank you guys so much for following us along, joining us, subscribing to our channel, following our channels and liking our videos. And if you haven't done so already, please click that subscription button below here on YouTube if you haven't. It helps out our channel and our algorithm. It helps us get more of these videos out to like-minded 2A individuals like yourself. So thank you guys for liking the videos also. That really does help out our algorithm to help us grow, which we wanna keep doing. We wanna be able to keep putting out quality content and bringing you more products in the future here. So by doing so, that helps us. So let's go ahead and smash that like button. Now, let's get into this product review. This is the TSIS PX9 G3 Tactical 9mm pistol. It is imported by SDS Imports, who also imports um, and does 1911s, does shotguns, does rifles, does other pistols, anything at all, really. SDS has a whole cloud of um, manufacturers underneath them that they import for. But again, this is the thesis. Now, we're gonna go ahead and take this nine millimeter pistol off to the side. First off, we're gonna talk about the case. So thesis does a great job with product delivery, giving you a nice hard shell case. It does lock there, so if you wanna throw some locks on it, you can also do so there. And we'll go ahead and open this guy up. So first off, we'll zoom in here, get you here. So you get your bore brush, Right there, you're gonna get your uh, bore rod, you're gonna get instruction manuals behind the foam there. And inside of here, you are gonna get two magazines. So you're getting two nice capacity magazines. The first one is an 18 round nine millimeter capacity magazine there. And the secondly, you're getting a 20 round, an 18 plus two, so 20 round capacity magazine there with a speed loader. So you're getting two magazines, 18 and 20 round magazines, which is great capacity for a nine millimeter. You're also gonna get this very unique IWB holster here. This guy, pretty slick, and it is different than you'll see on most holsters, but go ahead and take this, and it just slides right on over, and you got an IWB holster right there for you. Again, clip, pop it in right there. But again, IWB holster, small, compact, doesn't take up a whole lot of room for that guy. Also, inside of this case, you're gonna get some extra back straps, small, medium, and larges, depending on white or black, whatever you wanna change it up. If you wanna do an all white or a white and black pistol, by all means, you got that option to do so. So let's go ahead and get rid of these guys, put these guys back in the box there. We'll get this out of the way. All right, that is the product delivery case for the TSIS PX9 G3 Tactical. Let's go ahead and get into this guy. TSIS PX9 G3 Tactical Pistol. Safety check, empty magwell, chamber is empty, never been fired, brand new. So let's go ahead and review this guy. First off, 5.1 inch barrel, 8.2 inches overall length. The weight on this guy is 1.8 pounds. So one pound, eight ounces, 24 ounces overall. With that, it is a polymer frame. It does have a steel slide. As you're gonna see, it's got some nice porting on the slide too. Aggressive slide cuts. With the steel frame or with the steel slide, it does take a little bit more to rack it, right? It's not gonna rack real easy, which is also nice, especially in my preference. If I run an IWB and I'm bouncing around or it's inside of my waistband, I don't want this racking around, maybe trying to chamber an extra round or jamming up or anything if I really needed to pull it out and use it right away. So having a little extra heft to that slide is really nice. But once you rack it, there you go. And the trigger pull on this guy, there you go, very nice quick trigger pull trigger break and a quick reset. So helps you acquire, get back on target really fast. It does have the threaded barrel also on it. With the trigger, it is a tactical trigger safety, right? So it's got the safety blade in there. So you can pull your trigger all you want and you're not gonna do nothing until you push in that safety blade. And you really, this one is kind of oversized. You really have to push that safety blade in more than usual to be able to pull that trigger. So that is also one nice added benefit. There's no manual safety on it. It does have adjustable rear sights right there, adjustable rear sights with a fiber optic front sight. So let's go ahead and zoom in. Maybe fiber optic front sight with adjustable rear sights there. It is optic slide cut plate ready, RMR style optic. So if you got an RMR optic, go ahead and throw that bad boy on there and you are good to go. Now, also within the pistol here, 
is, like I said, we can also change out the back strap, small, medium, large, depending on the size of your hands. I've already put on the flared magwell for this guy. That there also allows my hand, because I got big hands, gives me a little extra real estate to grab that magwell, right? And grab the pistol grip. So very nice to be able to have some extra underneath still to be able to hold onto that guy really tight and really firm. Other than that, threaded barrel, if you want to suppress your nine millimeter pistol, you got the option to thread it or to suppress it also. So that is also awesome. As a bonus inside of our shop here at JK Firearms, this guy, the PX9 G3 Tactical, does take P226 magazines by SIG, right? The SIG P226 magazines will fit this guy. We throw in a 32 round magazine right there. This is a 32 round magazine. Pop that guy in. Now you're at the range. You got 32 rounds without even having to reload. Pretty cool. Again, not really feasible for maybe conceal and carry or anything if you really wanted to. But again, for range day, it's great. You don't have to reload magazines all the time with a 32 round. And as an extra added bonus, we have gathered up a P226 50 round drum, right? Looks kind of ridiculous with this guy. But again, if you're at the range, who cares about looking ridiculous? You don't have to reload as much as the other people, right? So you got a, right here, we'll get the tags all the way. A 50 round drum on your P or P226 50 round drum for your TSIS PX9 G3 tactical pistol. Very cool. Again, Stormtrooper edition. They do make other colors out there, but we like the Stormtrooper editions, especially in the winter time here in Minnesota. We haven't had much snow, but the Stormtrooper edition, whether it's shotguns, it's rifles, it's pistols, anything at all, very, very popular usually during the winter time because of all the snow. Blends in really well, but again, any time is good for white. It does get a little bit dirtier faster, but hey, easy to clean off, right? So let's go ahead and clean it off and it still looks really cool having a white pistol. So other than that, thank you guys so much for joining us, following us along every day. Again, please like this video, smash that like button down below, subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already. And as always, stay safe, fire down range, and we will see you soon. Oh, 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 oh,